What's up guys, this is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to do a benchmark test comparison between Huawei Mate 30 Pro and Huawei P40 Pro smartphones. Both of these smartphones they are pretty much same in terms of hardware aspect. The only difference is in terms of Emotion UI version. Both of them got Green 990 processor, 8GB RAM, 256 GB storage, Android 10 and a Full HD Plus screen. So the benchmarking applications we got today here they are Antutu Benchmarking, 3 d Mark Geekbench 5. We have already performed all of these tests to save your time and we are just going to have a quick look on the benchmarking test score results. So let's just start it. So first of all let's just start with Antutu Benchmark. Huawei P40 Pro scored 467,916 and Mate 30 Pro scored 443,446. So the winner is P40 Pro here. If you go to the individual test score result here, you can compare the result of CPU, GPU, memory, and UX. And as you can see that in CPU, GPU, memory, UX, in all of these four tests, performance of P40 Pro is slightly better compared to Mate 30 Pro. And that's why it is also scoring overall more points. So in Android benchmark, the winner is Huawei P40 Pro. Now let's go back from here and let's have a look on 3D Mark. It's a gaming benchmarking test. So first of all, let's have a look on the slingshot. In that, Mate 30 Pro scored 4,284 and P40 Pro scored 4,090. Talking about the Slingshot Extreme in OpenGL, Mate 30 Pro scored 5,742 and in Slingshot Extreme Vulcan, it is scored 5,406 while P40 Pro scored 5,706 in Slingshot Extreme OpenGL and 5,481 in Slingshot Extreme Vulcan. So in out of these three tests, in two of them, Slingshot and Slingshot Extreme OpenGL, the winner is Mate 30 Pro and in Slingshot Extreme Vulcan, the winner is P40 Pro. So in this test, we can consider Mate 30 Pro as a winner because out of these three, in two of them, performance of Mate 30 Pro is better. Let's go back from here and let's have a look on the last test of today and that's Geekbench 5. This one is divided in two parts, CPU and Compute and CPU is once again divided in single core and multi core. So in single core, Mate 30 Pro scored 756 and in multi core, it scored 2953. P40 Pro scored 757 in single core and 3073 in multi core. So as you can see that in these two tests, the winner is P40 Pro. The difference is just of one point in single core result. But in multi-core, it's a bit more, but we have to consider overall and in both of them, the winner is P40 Pro. Now let's go back from here. Let's have a look on the compute test score result. And once again, the difference is very minute. So P40 Pro is the winner because it has scored 3675 and Mate 30 Pro has scored 3671. So once again, as you can see, the difference is pretty negligible. But again, the winner is P40 Pro. So in Antutu Benchmarking and Geekbench 5, the winner is Huawei P40 Pro and in 3D Mark performance of Huawei Mate 30 Pro was better. But if you are talking about the overall performance in real life scenarios, both of them are going to perform pretty much same because as I said in the very beginning that both of them got exactly same hardware. The only difference is in terms of software optimization. So it does not matter which device you are going to get, you will be happy with the performance because both of them are going to perform exactly same. So that's all for now friends, thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe the channel and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notification for future uploads and I'll see you guys next time in another video, have a nice day.